only ones. They lost to Kazakhstan. Yeah, I'm excited to watch. I think on Friday, Sweden's meeting uh, Britain. Which will uh, be funny, because they suck. And if Sweden now needs to win every single game, that means that's going to be a very entertaining game. Uh, it's like a... It's like a... Grand Champion in Rocket League meeting a Silver. Like, that should be hilarious. Uh, and it should be very entertaining because they're just going to try harder because they need to win. And with how it's been going, Britain might actually win. All of these weird games. You prefer hockey over football? Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're basically smurfing. Yeah, exactly. Yes! Right, for those who missed the last session, I'll summarize after this cutscene. Yes! What's he doing? Is he preparing a bomb? What is this? Slatan isn't in the Euros, Ilil. He had knee pain and his doctor say said he can't play. Okay, everyone. Keep it down. Cole Phelps joins the Arsenal squad today. <laughs> How'd you like porking that German whore, Phelps? <laughs> Phelps is up before a review board in December. Until then, he works the Arsenal desk. End of story. Phelps. Yes, sir. I don't care what you did or didn't do, Phelps. I hear you're a good case man. But if you fuck up on my detail, I'll have you out of here before your feet touch the ground. Do we have an understanding? Yes, sir. Cap, we don't want a fucking rat like Phelps. Can it, Tilden? Phelps, I'm partnering you with Herschel Biggs. I don't do partners. You know that, Cap. You do now, Biggs. Have, have we been partnered with Herschel before? Like you two should get along just I recognize fine. him. Biggs will show you the ropes, Phelps. This is arson. There are no ropes. It shouldn't take long, then. Start with these two. House fires. 326 South Kenmore Avenue. Stefan's family was out of town when it happened. Then go to 4414 Rosewood, family by the name of Sawyer. Fire brigade will be on location. Are they suspicious, Captain? That's for you to find out, Detective. Now get out of here. Both of you. Yeah, Rusty. Get out! Might be reminding me of him. I say we bust in there and find the goddamn evidence. Dude, the amount of I times I'm the new guy. The How many years does this game take place in? Because I feel like I it's happening every other week. <laughs> okay, so we're in arson now. So for those who don't know, I went back to this game after ha not having played it since August, and um, we did a session this weekend. Yes. Uh, basically, basically to summarize, we were doing a case and uh, about some drugs being smuggled with the military, and they're selling weapons and stuff, and. Lot of drugs uh, with this mafia boss, and we had him cornered about it. And then um, there's some drama about a prostitute in the precinct. Uh, if anyone could fill me in what the drama was, I think like the chiefs slept with her or something like that. Uh, and because they didn't want that to be the news, they came out with a story about how we, the main character, this menu blinks a little. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, the main character slept with a German woman. And so that came out instead, and that was the drama. And they used that to cover up their story. Um, and we had an affair with the German woman because our partner saw us go in over the night and stay with her. And that's very bad back then. It's illegal, in fact. So we've been now degraded. We're in the arson squad instead. 
and um, our wife has kicked us out. Hi everyone, I hope you're having a lovely Tuesday, where... Oh, I've got a sneeze, it might... No, it's gone. Uh, we're playing some L.A. Noir, uh, trying to finish this game. Maybe I'll see you in chat. Much love, guys. Yeah, demoted. Let's go to Stefan's house fire. Listen, man, you drive. You know the way. You can drive. Uh, last time the blinking was happening, and then it kind of stopped, so I'm hoping it'll stop. Uh, it's just this game, and I don't know why. Chemist Entry, thanks for the two subs. We can do the small talk thing now. Talk baseball, it's very cute of you, thank you. I don't think so. Feeling down, hotshot? Need a buddy? Or look somewhere else. Thank you, Chemist Fet Butyl, Maki, and TK Alex. Welcome back, guys. Thanks for the 34 months. My resolution is correct. It might be a result of me going 60 FPS. If it happens a lot and doesn't stop, I'll uh, go back to 30. The game's not meant to be played at 60. There isn't much left. There never is if the job's done properly. You think it was deliberate? Nah, that's real pain in your face. They would have moved out the things they care about if this was insurance. There's no mileage in this. Hello, Mike. Hey, Hirsch. Cap this one. Yeah, Mike Brannigan, Cole Phelps. It's okay, Brannigan. His name may be dog shit, but there's none in his hand. No offense, Phelps. None taken. Do you have anything? The fire started late last night. Stefan's family at Catalina Island. Won some kind of competition. It's like the only thing they ever won in their lives. And they come home with us. I'd say they were pretty lucky, really. They don't have any insurance. Everything they own, including the house, is not a pile of rubble. Where are they sleeping? Oh, in shit. The car. It's lucky the whole block didn't burn down. Where it is, they're bulldozing this whole neighborhood to build new homes for GIs. That's the man in the house. In the ruins. Oh. Terry Lady is his wife. They, we'll they're around. bulldozing the house, on, the, the whole street for new houses, and this house, they were the only ones saying, no, we won't budge, we want to keep our house. And so they burned it. That's gonna be the whole case. Mr. Stevens? Cole Phelps and Herschel Biggs. LA it's gonna be one of those, like, we want to sell all these houses and make fresh time. stuff, you know? Could we have a word? Don Stevens. You were out of town. We won a prize. We had a wonderful time. Came home to this. Do you still have the tickets? Sure. It's a formality, but we'll need to speak to the issuing agent. Seems too predictable. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? The classic. Can you tell me any more about the prize that you won, Mr. Stephens? Weekend at Catalina Island. My uh, wife got this flyer in the mail from the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Truth. Did you enter any kind of competition? Uh, my wife filled in a flyer. The lady just rung up and told us we won. It's the first time I ever won anything. So they got them out of the house. The redevelopment fund. Did they offer to buy you out? They're building new houses. They showed their money and most of the neighborhood just packed up and walked away. But I never bargained with them. Boom. GI what? Houses? Yeah, something like that. Damn it! That's all we need for the moment. He looked... He looked good! Right. Did he not look good? I thought he looked good! So he must have bargained with them. <laughs> Damn it! Nothing significant. Damn, come on. 
Come on. Get your get your eyes in the game. This is going to help us. I, I said I never bargained. Not, of course he bargained. He'll have asked for too much of a too high of a price. Okay, uh, it's an okay question not to get the right answer on. We know. Is going to be we know he. Well, we know he bargained. It's gonna be a classic. We've already solved the case. Restart? No, I can do this. That son of a bitch looks a lot like the top of point of the gun. It would take a smarter man than me to connect that. Yeah, let me know in like five minutes if it's still flickering a bunch. Last time it kind of stopped. Isn't that the cop who caught yes! the guy to be dead? What a waste! I'll take this. Oh, okay. Recently serviced. Oh, never mind. We did have some. Never mind. It said intuitions left, didn't it? I thought it said clues. Recently serviced, Matthew Ryan. Interesting. Let's go call. Maybe we could look up this Matthew Ryan guy. Did you read about the woman who stabbed her husband and then pushed him in front of the car? That's the cop who caught him. Cole Phelps, batch 1247. How could I help, detective? I need information on the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Yes, detective. Just checking. Ooh, the this arson is thing is kind of fun. The agency is established to speed up the building of GI homes. It has private investors as well as a government endowment. Huh. Do you have an address for them? There is one listed here, corner of Beverly and Mariposa. Thanks. Hmm. Let's do Sawyer first. Check out the other house fire. Have there been any other house fires? This is arson. We get an average of two a night. Does that answer your question? Run, Two a night? That can't be accurate. This guy's a liar. You like to leave your mark, don't you? Loud? Is the game loud for you guys? Do I need to turn it down? Are we good? Can you hear me? How can you have, how can you have a, a house and not have any insurance, man? Come on! Full of advice, aren't you? That's insane to me. I don't think you can nowadays. Uh, I think you can. Like, it's not illegal not to have insurance, right? Heaven's to Betsy. 
Here they they like nail it in your head like get insurance on the day that you move in. Do not miss a single fucking day. Cuz if shit happens on that day, you're screwed. Hi, Albert. We've got this case. Hey, Biggs. We you have a partner? What gives? This is Cole Phelps. You may have read about him. Oh. Now I get it. Hello, Phelps. Welcome to the netherworld of ours. Family of four found dead in their beds. Heater explosion. Okay, another one. Looks that way. Mm. It's the heat. It's gonna be the seven. same. Before you get excited, we get a couple of water heaters a month go back. Take a look around the yard and see what you can find. It's gonna be the same um, service, I bet. Hey, hey big. Is this eight. significant? 50 quid. 50 quid. Regulator valve. Good find. Detectives? This is the next door neighbor. Detectives. Second case. Can you help? They were supposed to be going away. They want a trip somewhere. This is such an easy but case. I've already got it. Cancel. What are the chances? Do you know who ran the competition? Gulliver's Travel up on Santa Monica Boulevard. Thanks. You've been a big help. Phelps, the guy across the street. I've seen him before. He likes fire. He likes fires. Hurry, All right, hold on, Cadis. I'm just gonna jump. catch a pervert here. Got Stop. you. LAPD. What? We're running fire. together. Stop right there. What's happening? Wait, he's behind me. Okay. I. <laughs> Got him! What's your name? Herbert Chapman. So you like fires? Some. Watching them or setting them? I don't want any trouble. You can Turn always catch him. Any arson. You can catch him jerking it in the background. You're a naughty boy, aren't you, Herbert? Oh, you're a I keep naughty myself boy. to myself. I keep myself to myself. Cigarette in a matchbox gives you a five or six minute delay. You want more time, you use a mosquito coil. Don't you, Herbert? You like this fire, Herbert? Hell no. I heard it over the fire radio. Sounded the fuck sweet. is this? When you finish following your leads, come and see me at the fire station. I have a theory about this. Will do, Lynch. Take this guy in. We might want him for questioning later. You got it, detective. Yo, Cadiz 50! The big 5-0 from the man himself just received an email saying, I passed the by far biggest exam in my studies. And man, I'm overflowing with joy. I felt like throwing up all day from the nervousness, but now it's time for a beer, a relaxing stream, maybe a victory wank later. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, congratulations, man. That's fucking awesome. That's a lovely feeling when you feel shit all day because you can't stop thinking about it. And then you get the good news. Hey, you're over. You're at the top of the mountain. And now you got your skis on. And you're heading down. Wait, why? Hold on. There's something left here that I've missed. Wouldn't it be crossed out if I'm done with it? Congrats, man. Thank you for the big donation. Oh. Wow. You gonna stick it out, Cole? I'm gonna try, Mal. What have you got? Family by the name of Sawyer. Mother, father, and two kids. All in bed from the looks of it. Oh, I'd say carbon monoxide poisoning. The burns are superficial. Time of death? I'd say about midnight. Anything more exact will take some time to determine. 
Lynch tells me this has something to do with a faulty water heater. Could be. There's been a spate of problems with a particular brand. I've got another angle in mind. You care to elucidate, Detective? Elucidate. This is a murder and not an accident. Sharing information has helped us solve quite a few cases together. I need something concrete, Mal, before the department gets wind of it. I'm an arson for a reason. I feel sorry for your wife and kids, Phelps, not for you. But you're a good case, man. One of the best I've ever met. I'll help in any way I can. Thanks, Mal. I'd say that's firm but fair. Why have you got such a hard on for this case? If it is murder, it's almost impossible to prove. Fire doesn't leave much evidence. There's no percentage in this. I think it's more than one case. They're house fires, Cole. Accidents, heater fires, gas explosions. There's got to be a reason. The reason is you want to be a star again. Forget it. Give it up. You'll feel better. There's something to this. I know it. What are you talking about? Arson is insurance. It's always been insurance. We still investigate the cases, Biggs. The people in this house are dead. Go soak your head, Phelps. This hero business is a full-time obsession with you. I'm gonna make this case. I'm gonna rub the department's nose in it. Help me, or stay out of my way. You got it? Lazy? Why do I keep getting the lazy detectives? Where am I going? Hold on. You know what, you prick? I want you to drive. You drive. I need to Wait, go hold on. Case notes. Actually, right. you know what? Where to? Fuck off. There might still be some evidence here. Oh my god. Am I... How about the insurance companies write these incidents up as acts of God? Oh, I hate this kind of place to navigate. I'm missing something. Here we go. A fan. A book was at the other house as well. Oh, really? He didn't seem very interested in it. Dude, I'm missing something. What am I missing? Because it crosses the location out when you're done, right? When you've gotten all the evidence. Hi. Hi. A little bit. Ooh, some rom. That would be lovely. Yes! Okay, it's not in the house. No, I checked the clock. He said no, didn't he? What the fuck? Maybe the vehicle, actually. It's a bit of far out, isn't it? No. Come on, chat. We can do this. There's a piece of ed evidence I need here. Do I even have any more intuition points? No. 
Where's the heater? Where do you find the heater? I'll check the clock again. He didn't say anything when I picked it up. I too had problems here. Did you end up finding it? This is very frustrating. I feel like I've checked the whole place. We out here? I mean, it won't be this far out. Quite far from the house. I do not like this. This is very frustrating. Here? Ah! For those who don't know, it goes, a l it is a little ding when you walk over something you can pick up. That we're looking for. We're looking for a. Ping. Oh, that's some music. If I was a clue, where the fuck would I be? Yeah, what's up? Thank you. Alex, I can't find this clue. Hmm, thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you. That's clue. What's that? Ah, uh, it's just random shit. In the doghouse? No, uh, check the doghouse. I, like, I know that there's another clue that I've missed, and so... I don't want to go on. Oh. oh, it's this again. Yes! This is the third time I'm checking this clock. I think it's outside in the chimney thing. Oh god, I really wish I didn't use that intuition point! Are we sure that there's something left? The mailbox? Where's the mail? Oh. Oh. Yes? Do you remember what it is, Crash? I, I give up. You're gonna be my intuition point. There is music, there's still a clue. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Near the front of the house on the white path.
Oh, I was the clue all along. Found on the ground a few feet away from the house to the right when facing it. Didn't I already find that? That was a... Uh, that was like a, a, a thing. Oh, here, what's this? Huh? Yeah, I already got the pipe part. That was, yeah, I already found that. Find anything? No, I really didn't. But my intuition tells me there's something here. In that case, that's it? But then why the fuck is it? Why the fuck is it? It's still play. You got all clues. I think it's a glitch. Go to the right side of the house and you'll find a water heater marked with a C. In the front yard to the right of the house is a newspaper. You will find cigarette butts yes. next to a tree in the neighbor's front yard to the left of the crime scene. Next to the cigarette butts are boot prints. You'll find cigarette butts next to a tree in the neighbor's front yard. Are you sure that's this one? Go to the right. Can you copy paste that again when that disappears, Kalis? Go to the right side of the house and you'll find a water heater marked with a C. A water heater marked with a C. Are you sure that's this? It, we're at. We're at a house. What house are we at? He's already found it. There's no more clues. Yeah, I think. I think you're on the wrong mission. Yeah, uh, we're gonna move on. I think it's glitched. You're behind the wheel. Why are you crossed out oh, yeah. now? You were not crossed out before. And now I've walked around for 10 minutes and you're crossed? This game, dude. I... I didn't... There's no... I didn't find anything. Ooh. No, it was not crossed out before, Pavlada. Pavlada, if you can show me a clip of it being crossed out before, I will gift 30 subs to my chat. Hey, Kadish, man. Big thank you for that big donation. You really didn't have to do that. I should be... I should be gifting you. To celebrate. Congratulate you. Detectives Phelps and Biggs, LAPD. John Cunningham, can I help you, gentlemen? We have reason to believe that the Sawyer family of 4414 Rosewood Avenue recently won a competition run by your company. Yes, I remember them. They called up to cancel at the last minute. One of the kids was sick. Very unfortunate. Do you mind if I take a look at that? Oh, shit. Sawyer family, Rosewood Avenue. What was the other family called? <laughs> Stephens, thank you. Here they are, Stephens. Okay.
Alex, the, the dog is barking at something. Tell us about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. There's not much to tell. They run a promotion. Our promotions mailing list covers half of LA. So they are not a government agency? <laughs> I don't believe so. Government organizations don't usually get involved in promotions. Mm -hmm. I'm told the tickets were a prize. Yes, they were. You do a lot of these prizes. Look, He's nervous. there are hundreds of these promotions running at any one time. If you're the lucky guy, you get your name pulled out of a hat. And... Hmm. I'm going to hit him with doubt, I think. What's my evidence? How do I get my evidence? Hit him with doubt. While the Sawyer family were supposed to be at Catalina Island, their house burnt down. You consider them lucky. Christ. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me who offered the prize won by the Sawyer family? Sure. Look, there's supposed to be some sort of supervised draw with hundreds of tickets. But the reality is the Suburban Redevelopment Fund calls me every couple of weeks and tells me exactly who has won. Boom. Got Extra them. Help. Uh, no problem. I just wish I could do something for that family. You could put round the half. A few bucks would really help them now. I suppose so. Good. I'll put you down for 50. I could tell you yes. were Samaritan the minute I walked in the 50? door. 50? Are you good man, Cunningham? You're all right. Yeah, I'm great. Poorer, but great. $50 back then. That's a lot of money. Isn't that like $500 today? Or something like I feel like that's an insane amount of money. You can drive. And where exactly are we going? Let me guess. You want to check out the suburban address? Great partners must think alike, Herschel. $556? Really? Wow. $800. About $600. Mm, yeah, it's a lot of money. That's a bad this guy. This is supposed to be the registered offices of the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. This is an Elysian Housing Development, Mac. So Elysian is an investor in the Redevelopment Fund. Looks that way. Are we done here, Mac? I've got work to do. Sure, buddy. Thanks for your help. What? Elysian are investors in the Suburban Redevelopment. So what? If you think I'm putting my pension on the line and harassing Leland Monroe without evidence, you're out of your mind. Lynch says we should visit him at Fire Station 32. With this Who's exactly Elysian? Is this guy, Lynch? Lynch is a legend. You should feel privileged. He doesn't let many people into the inner sanctum. Keep your mouth shut. And you'll learn something about fires. Who is Elysian? Do we know who Elysian is? I was kind of attached to the paint job, Cole. They talked about a lesion as if we know it, but I, I don't know what a lesion is. Any central unit, ambulance shooting, any central unit, identify. I like how we can still go to shootings, even though we're in the arson squad. Um. Fet, Bureau, Bucket, TK, Alex, Harrison, Seymour, welcome back, guys. Uh, I read some of you earlier, but thanks again. Thanks for the four years, Harrison Seymour. Hell yeah, man. Buns Game, Rhino Nino, Dat Darth, welcome back. Have a good one, man. Thank you. And Rays of Death with 29. Just watching your Rocket League streams have been a chill time. Much love. Thanks, man. That that means a lot to hear. We came as soon as we could. This town is going straight to hell. That's the creep. Elysium Fields Development is a company point. building these new houses. Oh. Lynch. Biggs. You two investigating the house fire on Kenmore Avenue as well? Yep. Why? I had a look around the place while I was out there. Do you believe the fire? I deal in facts, Phelps. Evidence of an explosion. No obvious sign of accelerants. 
wiring looks intact. Come and take a look at this. This the heater from the Sawyer fire out? Yes, it is. Huh. Looks like it was recently serviced. By the same guy. I have a theory, and it's a theory only. I don't have enough evidence to prove... Al, if you say it so, we're listening. Okay, Phelps. You're a bright penny. You have a gas supply. You have a Bunsen burner as a pilot light. You have a regulator valve, and the balloon represents the gas expanding in the room. Now, the gas has to make contact with the mosquito coil to form an explosion. Let's see if you can work out the chain of events. What? Uh, oh. Different guy? Okay. Couldn't remember the name. Okay. So. We have a... We have... Uh, and then we have a... A balloon. No, no, blue. And then, and then blue. Blue thing. Just, okay. Boom. Oh, that's the balloon. No, that's not it. Come on, Phelps. You need what? to get the arrangement right before we can reproduce the results. That's the balloon. So the balloon... Oh no. Oh, yeah. What's this? I don't know. I don't know what this is. That goes there, I guess. But the balloon... That's there. The gas yeah. bubble needs to be next to the coil if it's gonna ignite. Yeah. The gas bubble. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, because that's the spark. Yeah, and then the balloon. The balloon is... I don't know what this blue thing is. I I really don't. I, boom. It's ready. Well, you've put me in this situation without knowing what everything is. What is this blue thing? Try again, Boy Scout. I don't know what this is. Good, your regulator's in position. Okay, it's a regulator. I don't know what a regulator do, uh, valve is. Mm. He's struggling here. I thought you said- Try again, Boy Scout. Yeah, bro, yes. this fucker played me. He said, the gas needs to be next to the, the fission in order to ignite. Oh, do you mean? Oh, yeah, because the balloon is playing okay. as the pilot. gas. Turn okay. The gas. Or yeah. You pull the lever okay, on the left I get it. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now, boom. Yeah, I get it. It's a metaphor. Boom. Yeah. Oh, can you imagine? Whew. So that's how it's being done. Yeah. Maybe. Got it. There could be a fault with these valves. I've adjusted this one for our experiment, but you need to take it to InstaHeat and see what they say. Their headquarters is on North Harvard Boulevard, number 262. Got Thanks, it. Albert. You're welcome, Biggs. See you at the next show. Come on, let's go. No time to waste. Show? The next fire. You should go to the factory and see how many of these things are going bang in the night. You know this Chapman character? Guy's a freak. Loves fires. He's the kind of guy that we'd like for a lot of things, but we don't really have any credible evidence to pursue him with. Nah. Nah. Any century unit, any it's not him. Unit, in progress, 522 South Hill Street, unit it's not him. Three, 
Bro, your fault. Let's go. <laughs> To get there in one piece. Go fuck yourself. Oh, I missed up. Sorry. Okay. Yes. LAPD detectives, ma'am. We need to speak to someone in charge. I see. Well, duty manager for today is Mr. Rasick. Hello. You should yeah. find him in his office. Got it. Let's go. Ivan! You greedy motherfucker. How the hell are you? Where are you? You're a real asshole, you know that? Who the fuck is Ivan? That son of a bitch looks a lot like the cop who pointed his gun at me. And I thought this was such a nice area. New and improved model. They'll be selling these like hotcakes. How bad is it? Come on, you can tell me. Detective Phelps and Biggs, arson. We're investigating a couple of house fires. What can you tell us about this? Pressure regulator from a Model 70. Yeah. Let me take a look. It's been toyed with. We saw it in the intro. We have a problem. This has been tampered with. What? You see this diaphragm? It forms a seal across the saddle here. Gas flows across from here to here. The diaphragm regulates flow. been reversed. It's a subtle change, but it means the gas never closes off properly. So you're telling me that this is not a manufacturing fault or service repair? I don't think there's anything inherently wrong with the design. Wait, what? But you just said... Hold on. Sorry about this, this happens when I pause. It's been reversed, it's a subtle change, but it means the gas never closes off properly. So you're telling me this is not a manufacturing fault or service repair? I don't think there's anything inherently wrong with the design. Okay. I'm gonna hit him with doubt, because he looks like he's a little queasy. You're telling me that you've never had any problems with this heater? Look, we've changed the design since the Model 70. These things are still being installed? It's the demand. None of us could keep up with the amount of housing going up. At the budget end, we're still using some of the old stock. We are installing 100 heaters a week. They're not all faulty. They're not all safe, either. Are these diaphragms prone to failure? They uh, tend to go after a while. The rubber lasts quite a few years and then it perishes. So the guy's names that I've been seeing doing the repairs on the heaters, they're fully licensed and accredited. Sure, of course they are. What's my evidence on this? Can I set it up with lie? And uh, I think it's just doubt. I don't know who Matthew Ryan is. Reginald. Yeah, I don't know who they are, so I'm gonna do doubt. You employ what? accredited mechanics to do this. What's my evidence? Installers, uh, technically, they're gas fitters. Installers, then. They know what they're doing, detective, if that's what you're trying to imply. He looked like he was... I want you to get me a copy of the list of your installers. Okay, I'll get it for you. 
Stand, there, the around a dozen of them. Housing business is going crazy at the moment. This is a long shot. We are not going to rouse that whole list. I want to run it by R&I, cross-reference for arsonists. See if any of these guys have any previous. Sir, I need to use your phone. Go right ahead. Are you liquored up? Yeah, the Matthew guy isn't on the list. Hey, buddy. You dropped something? Fuck you. Where's the phone? Isn't that the cop that caught the guy that was pretending to be dead? Only movie stars have things like that. Goddamn Harry thinks he could get fresh whenever he freezes. No? That's not a... Is somebody gonna tell us Oh, their names were backwards. My bad. I was reading uh, their last name, son. Mister, a man like you always loses a battle of wit. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. What the hell? Phelps badge twelve forty seven. How can I help, Detective? I need to know if any of the following names have a previous criminal history. Okay, Detective, run the names. Acevedo Ernesto, Clemens Walter, Elgram John, Gable Leroy, Kellegrew Peter, Cutner Robert, Limehouse Albert, <laughs> Manning <laughs> Franklin, <laughs> Neves Raymond, O'Brien Thomas, Ryan Matthew, Spurgeon William, Varley Reginald, Zurich Stephen. Did you get that? Clemens Walter, previous conviction for arson and malicious damage. Burned down a house in Westwood in 1942. Four year jail term. Thanks. Ryan Matthew, charged for contempt of court, attempted murder, plea bargain down to assault charge. Anyone else? There is a Reginald Varley wanted for murder by Detroit Police Department. Thanks. You've been a big help, young lady. How bad is it? Come on, you can tell Your me. Your employment roster is quite the rogues gallery, Mr. Rasick. Desperate times indeed. Sam's taking me out of Palm Springs for the weekend. What? Are you Why am I looking at this? I thought we were going to talk. Huh? Hey, buddy. You dropped something? Do you have an address for Clemens? He's uh, working on an apartment building on uh, Catalina and 3rd. What about Ryan? Currently working at a housing development on... Normandy and First Street. Varley, where is he? Beverly and Mariposa, currently working on a new housing development. Hey, Varley's a good guy. You can't harass all my people. These guys have lockers. Yes, they do, but my men have a right to some privacy. Don't you need a warrant or something? Show him and keep quiet. What the heck, fire? Here. Happy now? Stick around, Mr. Rasick. Clemens is a fellow traveler. What? That's it? Clemens is a fellow... Is that all I'm going to look at here? Oh yeah, okay, he just... Okay, yeah, that's him. That's Clemens. Matthew. Oh, wow. Seems irrelevant. Some light reading on the merciless capitalist machine. Ryan wants the world to be a better place, don't we all? So he's selling them. A 
company went through thousands of these in the war. Still got eaten alive. Seems like I'm missing something, though. It automatically picks it up. Yes! Barley has a problem with bugs. <gasps> That's how he set off the bomb thing! Boom! You know that a mosquito coil takes an hour to burn down, Rasik? No, I didn't know that. It's a favorite choice of ignition by arsonists. Gives them time to get away. You're crazy. He probably lives near the canals in Venice. Mind if I leave you to it? I got work waiting. Fuck off, mate. Three birds. It loads? Why does it load? What's about to happen? He's about to do another one. Yes! We gotta get him. Before it's too late. Get in! Did we see who that was? Did we see who it was? Was there any evidence on who it was? Was it Varley? How'd you know? How did we know? Sorry, I had to answer a message from a friend. Oh, he had the mosquito thing. Okay, thank you. Farley's on the run. He might be packing heat. If he's wanted for murder, I say we take the doubt out of the equation and let him have it. You nervous? It's been a while. You were in combat. In 1917. No, I never fired my weapon in the line of duty. That's nothing Whoa! to be ashamed of. I hope your piece is still serviceable, Herschel. I may be old and out of practice, but I'm still a Marine, Phelps. Hold on! It would be better for our case if we could bring him in, Herschel. We're gonna catch him in the act. LAPD, Varley! Stop or I'll shoot! I kind of want to catch him and not kill him. Come on, Barley. You can't keep running forever. Am I meant to... I don't want to kill him. Hold on, check this out. Can't get in the cars. Yes! What is this bullshit?! Maybe just a quick foot shot. You run all the way from Michigan, Reginald. And stay down. Got him. I had to stop aiming to do that. Why did you run from us, Varley? I'm gonna take a wild guess that you're the same Reginald Varley the Detroit police have an outstanding warrant on. How am I doing so far? I need a lawyer before I talk to any of you. Reginald Varley, you're under arrest for committing a series of arsons. You're also under arrest for murder. Detroit PD will be putting in a request for your extradition. Until then, your guest is- Arson? You, you can't hang that rap on me. Be quiet. 
Be thankful we don't shoot you. Are all the cops in this town crazy? Take him away, officer. So we have to choose who it was. Let's go to the next guy. Or no. Can you drive to this one? So where do you want to go? God. Biggs, LAPD. We want some answers and we want them quick. Okay, okay. What's this all about? Just tell me what you want. You know Reginald Barley? No. Can't say I do. Now, I, I, I want to go doubt, but I'm just going to check my evidence again. Wait, hold on. Didn't he sell a book to you? Who was the book guy? Who am I talking to right now? Clemen. Varley... No, that was Ryan, wasn't it? That was Ryan. Matthew Ryan. Yes! And I got spoken for distribution fund and Matthew Ryan. And this is Clemens. Varley had the mosquito coils. Yeah. Uh... Who am I asking him about? What was my question? Right, Reginald Varley. Thank you. Yeah. I mean, you're co-workers. I'm just gonna go with doubt. Detroit PD is after Reginald Varley for murder. You want us to run you in for aiding and abetting Clemens? Whoa, 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 whoa. All I know about Varley is he gets kickbacks from some developer. Does their work first. Spreads it around if he can. You're licensed and work for Instaheat? I contract for them. So what? What? What am I meant to? But don't lie. You... Okay. Your, your license work for in-state, I contract for them. No. You like fires, don't you, Clemens? You serve as the house on Kenmore Avenue. You manipulated the regulator valve. I don't remember even working a job on Kenmore Avenue, much less sabotaging the place. What proof have you got? Kenmore Avenue. Kenmore Avenue. Which one are you? You're Clemens. No, you're Varley. No. Yeah, you're Clemens. This. To be frank, you look like you haven't got a clue. Just, just give me a minute. You serviced the house on Kenmore Avenue. You manipulated the regulator vault. Kenmore Avenue. I don't even remember working a job on Kenmore Avenue. Which one is Kenmore Avenue? Yes! I swear we had him. Clemens. No, it was Ryan and Varley. What do we have from Clemens? We don't have anything from Clemens. We have this. But am I saying he's lying about... I'm really sorry about the blinking. Am I saying he's lying about... You're licensed and work for Instaheat. 
I contract for them, so what? And then I say lie. It's nothing personal. I'm just doing my job. You understand that. I'm gonna go with doubt, I think. I don't know what evidence I'd have for a lie. Instead, he hires arsonists, does it? I've worked as a fitter all my life. Put everything I had into that house. And my fucking mud shark of a wife gets awarded it in settlement. She's blowing spicks two at a time while I'm at work. And she gets the house. Yeah, I burnt it all right. Set fire to that fucker and watch it burn to the ground. I did my time and I'd do it again. Sorry about the rouse, Clemens. You did the right thing. What the fuck? You did the right thing? Do you know Matthew Ryan? No. Don't know the name. Aha! Lie! You and Ryan are fifth columnists. And how do you figure that, wise guy? What proof do you have? Been following me to meetings? I'll do you one better, Clemens. That's this, right? Boom. We found a pamphlet in your locker, Clemens. We can add your name to the register. Huack might want to interview you. That shit was from Ryan. He's always pushing that shit on people. Drives me nuts. He's got it in for the company. All right, Clemens. You're off the hook for the moment. Can I get back to work now? Let's get out of here, Phelps. He ain't our guy. Yeah, I don't think he's our guy either. You can drive. All right. Where to? Hey, Lido Jaden, thanks for subscribing, man. Uh, C Gaggler, Rhino Nino, Lone Cannon, welcome back. I've been watching your YouTube videos since the early siege days. I've only got to catch a couple of streams. Love the content, man. Keep up good work. Thank you. Thank you very much. Only the Hoya with a one year, vertical gifted hobbit with a 21 month. Are you Matthew Ryan? Thanks for the love. Who's asking? Detective Phelps and Biggs. Here we go, he's gonna run. Squad. He's gonna run! You heard the man. Let's just put this stuff in the car and I'll be right with you. Hold it, Ryan. I said. Go! Those are GI's backyards he's crashing through. The damage is only cosmetic. He's a one-man wrecking ball. Move in! He just hit I'm a man! Out the van. Smash the son of a bitch's rear wheels. He's going to kill those men. They'll get out of the way. Only if they hear him coming. Close in, Phelps. We need to take Ryan down before he hurts somebody. Sorry. He's in a company van and he's losing us, Cole. Some partner I got. Hey, listen, mate. You shut the fuck up. Where is he? How do I get... How do you go through that? Not the... Okay. Shoot him! What is this silent chase? Jesus, what is she doing? The tramp! Oh. oh, Jesus! I've got him now. I've forgotten how to sprint. Why am I? Ah, here we go. Put your hands in the air! Why did you run, Ryan? I was scared! You got a reason to be scared, Ryan? Matthew Ryan, I'm arresting you on suspicion of committing a series of arsons. Now, which one is it? Or is it both of them? Three suspects. As much as I'd like it to be Chapman, I think it's one of the other two guys. Let's get to the station and close this case. Oh, okay, so I have to choose who it is now. Cut it out! 
using, fuck you, using evidence. I'm not very good at this. Considering I'm a detective, I'm not a very good detective. I wouldn't feel safe in a tank with you driving. Hey, undercover table, good to see you thanks to the 38 months, and Almighty Cross thanks to the one year. Cheers, man. It's good that you're self-aware. Yeah, I mean, I may not be a good detective, but, but at least I know it. Where's your respect for property, Cole? I know what I'm doing. my little shortcut to the police station. <laughs> Fair question to be made, Katis. Mouthpiece store strips off me at the grand jury. Case got thrown out. I have two now suspects. Felt you got nothing. Biggs, Ryan's waiting for you in interview one. Varley's in two. Hey, Hopkins, you practicing your asshole routine again? Come on, Phelps. Nice one, dude. Let's Save yourself have some a chat. time and get this thing off your chest. <laughs> if that's your opening gambit, you better try again. Okay, here we go. I got you, Matthew. Let's do this. So you want to change the world, Ryan? Yes, I do. So does every reasonable person. And you're doing your part. Yes, I am. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about. God, I get scared. The difference between doubt and lie scares me. I get scared I'm going to hit them with doubt when I have evidence that they did it. But I don't have evidence that he did it, right? I'm not. Heater service by Ryan. Stefan's family heater destroyed after being serviced by Matthew Ryan. Either I hit him with lie. No, I don't think so. Yes. I think it's doubt, right? This isn't this doesn't prove anything. You think you can sweat me like this? Keep dreaming, copper. I'll click lie and see what he says. That's a good idea. This is industrial sabotage, Brian. It's all part of your campaign. You're delusional, detective. What campaign? No, I'm gonna do doubt. Looks like I was mistaken. Yes! <gasps> Last chance. Nay! Sending you to the DA. I, I hate this the game! For sedition and murder will do wonders for his re-election campaign. Nice try. But I got nothing to lose. What? What's the... What's the... What's the evidence? There's no evidence! You literally have a pamphlet of his campaign? Yeah, but... I do! But I thought we were still talking about the sabotage. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about. So I say, you're lying, and this is why. I, 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 and then he, but then now we're talking about the campaign? This game, it shouldn't be called lie. It should be called... Pressure him or something. I don't know. Like, oh, I... Ah! You know how to reverse a call out, the yeah. Later valve of a Model 70 heater. No, I don't. All right, what did you say? You know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't.
Okay. Well, do I doubt or lie then? Like... Why? Why do I click lie if... Why? Why if a guy says something, do I click lie? Like, if I don't know what I'm gonna be giving pr evidence of. Do you know what I mean? I can wait just as long as you can. Shut the fuck up. If this guy says something, and I'm like, lie, let's go to my evidence. I don't even know what I'm meant to be- why do I click that before I even know what I'm giving evidence of? Does that make sense? Am I making sense? He says A, and I'm like, ha, ah, lie, let me present some evidence about A. However, it's not about A, it's about what he says after I've said lie, right? Like, look at this, look at this. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about, right? So then I say lie, as if I'm meant to present evidence about this. But really, I then get made to present evidence about this. That frustrates me. The flickering is insane. It's mad, like me. Anyway, okay, so what did you say now? Do you know how to reverse the diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. Let's click lie and see what it is I could- what he says. If you know enough to do your job, you know enough to do that repair. You're lying, Ryan. And how do you think you can prove that? How do I prove that? Is it this? This isn't really evidence, is it? That it was destroyed after being serviced by him? Because this valve was recovered from the Sawyer residence. Not the Stefan's residence. You think you can sweat me like this? Keep dreaming, Shut up, let me think. Yes! I'm gonna go with my gut feeling. Looks like you're the one who needs advice on how to do his job. Ah! Oh, like that. You got nothing to say? Well, I'm not done. What? Why are we? What can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. The Suburban Redevelopment Fund, nothing. Tell me the truth, Ryan. It's the only chance you've got. You're getting some kind of kickback from the fund. So I'm an agitator for change, but I take kickbacks. How does that make any sense? Well, I don't have any evidence that he's getting kickback. I only have evidence that Walter Clemens is getting kickback. So let's hit well, him I with doubt mistake. on this one. I think Suburban is a front for your anarchist buddies. They're arranging for people to be out of town while you burn their houses down. Suburban? What's that got to do with me? That's Farley's bilk. 
He's the one with the cozy agreement with those fascists. You have a history of violence. I have no such thing. Lie. You're lying, Ryan. And how exactly are you going to prove that? This one I can prove, you little cunt. Boom. You were charged with attempted murder, Ryan. It was a court case. No criminal liability was the verdict. They said that they couldn't have known that the faulty heater installation would cause a fire. All I know is I lost my whole family. And the company that was responsible got away with it. What would you do? Which company? Asbestos Water Heater Company. That's it for the moment, Ryan. So I can go? Sure. As soon as your red friends storm the building and carry you out, you'll keep your seat until we decide how long... I'm tempted to alt F4 and restart this investigation. That really pissed me off, man. Two out of four. I... This game is just... It's so... It's so frustrating sometimes because I can't I can't tell what I'm meant to do. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Sometimes sometimes when you present lie, you're meant to you're meant to give evidence on the second thing they say. And then sometimes you're meant to just follow up. It's still you're still giving evidence on the first thing they said. Does that make? Does anyone know what I mean when I'm saying that? Damn it! Damn it. Yes! I get your point, but it only applied to the first one. But that's exactly what it didn't do. Let me show you. Casper, though, five gifted subs. Do you want a fact? He wants a fact. Did you know that... Humans, humans give birth to, women give birth to humans. We give birth to our babies really early compared to all other animals. If you look at, and the fact's coming up. If you look at any animal, you know, cows or whatever, just a few hours after they're born, they're already walking, right? Whereas we give birth to our babies and then we spend like, a year or two to even catch up to even that moment. And a big reason behind that is because humans stand on two feet. They're not bent down on all fours. And so our hips are much smaller. And so we can't afford to keep the baby growing inside of us longer because that would mean that we couldn't make uh, uh, give birth to them. So we ha we're forced to give birth to humans sooner than animals who are all on all, all fours because because our hips are much smaller. So they don't they don't we can't let them grow more uh, yes. before giving birth, and that's why we have babies that are absolutely useless. Whereas a lot of animals, they're born and then they just start walking because they actually have space for that and stuff. Something like that. <laughs> I'm kind of paraphrasing, but it's something like that I remember reading. Hold on, let me just... This game is very stupid. I need... It's very delayed unless I do this. Uh, oh. Yes! Thanks for the five. Casper, much love, man. Yeah, it's from the book I'm reading at the moment. Uh, 
Uh, Exodius, thanks for the sub. Welcome. Uh, Merkley with the four months. Jordan from Maple. 34 months. Much love. Notice me, Corona. Donarela photos. Welcome back, guys. And body bags, 47 months. Was, Thank you. Really nice guy. I felt lousy tolerating him. Poke with a gift and sub to Pokemon's armpits today. Welcome. Thank you, Poke. I have two suspects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got nothing. Can we skip? No. Thanks. Ryan's waiting for you in interview one. Carly's in two. Hey, Hopkins. You practicing your asshole routine again? Come on, Phelps. I know that face. That's the guy who busted okay. the Negro drug Let me give let me show you what frustrated Save me. Save yourself some time. I mean, yeah, I fucked up. But what frustrates me is how unclear it can be. <laughs> if that's your opening gambit, you better try again. So you want to change the world, Ryan? Yes, I do. So does every reasonable person. And you're doing your part. Yes, I am. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about. So here, it's presented to me not as if you're lying about wanting, like... He asked, do you want to change the world? Yes, and it's called anarchist literature, yes. But then it leads to him saying, did you destroy blah 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 blah. He says, did you... Basically saying, did you sabotage water heaters to destroy a company? And he says, I have no idea what you're talking about. And so, if I click lie here, then I'm cl clicking lie because I think I have evidence for him destroying the water heater. But in fact... This is industrial sabotage, Ryan. It's all part of your campaign. You're delusional, detective! What campaign? Suddenly, I'm not giving evidence to why... Uh, to him lying about destroying the... the... water heater. We're just talking about a campaign. And that's what threw me off last time. So now I'm just giving his campaign instead. What's his name? Is it Ryan? Who is this? Are we talking to Ryan? Ryan, thank you. Yeah, it's more like accuse, not lie. Exactly. Your locker is full of pamphlets. Clements told us how you were always foisting them on people. Sure. I spread the pamphlets. A guy has to do something. Insta-heat heaters break down every day. They're still peddling the same lousy design that they lifted from Hephaestos. Insta-heat bought out Hephaestos? Them, <gasps> Vulcan, Pyro, and a bunch of other companies. And you still work for them? A guy has to work. And the directors of the company. How do you feel about them these days? You work it out. You know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. It's something they changed in the remaster clearly because it led to confusions. Really? Is it not called lie in the remasters? What's it called? It's called there. Do I hit him with doubt here then? I guess I just hit him with doubt, right? Right? Do you know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. I don't know. I guess I'm just gonna... You think it's lie? But what the damn it? Yeah! Uh, curry would be nice. Cake, you think it's lie. I'm happy to do this one openly. Why do you think it's lie? I did lie last time and went with the fact that he was the la that it got destroyed after being serviced by him, which wasn't the way. The regular valve, but it wasn't, yeah, no, see, the, it was, the regular valve wasn't recovered from his. It was recovered from the Sawyer residence, which was serviced by Varley. So I think it's doubt. You expect me to believe that, Ryan. I could do it myself. <sighs> believe whatever you want, What's Flatfoot? the evidence You're part on that, of the then? I don't get it. I don't get it. Somebody tell me. 
What's the evidence on that? Is it truth? Does he just not know how to do it? Now you got nothing to say? Well, I'm not done! Oh, sorry, I was trying to look at my evidence. There we go. I guess it's just truth. I don't know, he looks so aggressive and <laughs> I just figured he was lying. What can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. Well, I'm okay with missing that one then. Um... What can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Is this just doubt? God, I can't even remember what I did now. I did doubt on this, right? It was the Ivan Razik statement here? Was that the evidence? I did look at that. Factory manager Ivan Razik testifies to ease of pressure regulator tampering. Tampering. That was the evidence? How easy it is. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that would have made sense. That would have made sense. Damn, that's that's a tough... That's a tough evidence to connect with it. I think, for me. Okay, yeah, cool. Uh, cool. I think Suburban is a front for your anarchist buddies. They're arranging for people to be out of town while you burn their houses down. Suburban? What's that got to do with me? That's Farley's bilk. He's the one with the cozy agreement with those fascists. You have a history of violence. I have no such thing. You're lying, Ryan. And how exactly are you going to prove that? I find it funny that he doesn't think that we know about this. You were charged with attempted murder, Ryan. It was a court case. No criminal liability was the verdict. They said that they couldn't have known that the faulty heater installation would cause a fire. All I know is I lost my whole family. And the company that was responsible got away with it. What would you do? Which company? Has faced those water heater company. That's it for the moment, Ryan. So I can go? Sure. As soon as your red friend storm right. the building and carry out, you'll keep your seat. I have to absolutely nail this other interrogation. I may not have completely pointed out that it's this guy. However, by a process of elimination, but procedure says we eliminate all of the suspects. Let's speak. Where's the other one? By a process of elimination, if I nail this second guy. Either I'll know it's him, or I know it's not him. And if it's not him, then it's the other guy. Then it's Ryan. We have Matthew Watch Ryan this. In custody, Barley. I think all we need to do is ask him about this, and he'll write you out. Fuck Ryan, that pinko bastard. Yes! Have you ever worked on a place on Rosewood Avenue? Family by the name of Sawyer? Maybe. I, I'm from out of town. I go where they send me. I, I, I don't do a lot of repairs, though. I'm flat out on new installations. Okay. Lie. Why are you lying to me, Barley? If Suburban wants their new installations completed, why are you bothering with Rex like the Sawyer house? So I'm lying just because I can't remember if I was there or not? <laughs> How can you prove that I was? And now... Uh... What's your name, Varley? Yeah. Your name is on the inside door of their water heater. Okay. You got me there. Suburban, yeah, they wanted that guy out. Sawyer kept complaining about not being able to get his heater service, so they threw in a free service as a sweetener. I think he played him, though. Because he still wouldn't sell. Word is, you're in the pocket of some property developer? Never. I got principles. <laughs> How did Suburban put the squeeze on you? Did they find out about your record? There's no way you can link me to Suburban. You're wasting your time. 
<laughs> Varley, Varley, Varley. I can do exactly that. If you just give me a second. Wait, what? Maybe not. Varley? You're in the pocket of some property developer, never. How did Suburban put the squeeze on you? Did they find out about your record? There's no way you can link me to Suburban. Varley by Suburban. Walter Clemens testifies to being offered kickbacks by Varley. But that doesn't connect him to... Suburban. Hey, buddy. Why don't you stand around some more while I sneak out that Will door? you shut the fuck up? Aha! We have Matthew Ryan saying that you're conspiring with Suburban. That's what I was looking for. Boom. Ryan says you offered to cut him in on the kickbacks they were offering. That's what it was. Good. That's good. Justify court. Suburban, they got real time pressure on getting some of the big developments finished. There's some big date that they can't afford to miss. So yeah, I took their money, but so did a lot of guys. All right, carpenters, electricians, plumbers. It's no big conspiracy. This is what where I nail you. The diaphragm of an Insta Heat Model Seventy do. Yeah, I made that mistake before. You get a big bang when you turn the pilot back on. So you didn't deliberately sabotage the water heater at the Sawyer house? No, I did not. You out of your mind? Maybe I am, big boy. I don't believe you, Varley. Yes! I think Suburban wants homeowners who don't want to sell out of the way. I think you're out of your mind. Where is the evidence that I have done anything to contribute to this fire? Huh? Now, this is where it gets difficult. At... It's simply this. This is the evidence. Let me just double check my notes. The evidence is the valve at the house being switched, right? At the Sawyer house. Varley, I'm just checking everything. It's gotta be this. Boom. You're saying I'm some kind of psycho for Really? Hire? But... <laughs> it's not true. Shit. Well, now I'm a little fucked. I can tell Tia's getting this wrong given how clear the answer is to me. Which one was it? I thought that was good. It was literally the part of what he serviced, but we know that the, that the thing is flipped in it. The mosquito coil? No, that wasn't that the third guy. The guy is not here. I swear that was the third well, guy. For now. So what happens? You're either going back to Detroit to face a murder rap, or you're staying here to answer for these arsons. That was Varley. Oh god, fucking cunt, bitch, dick. I hate this game so much. Oh. Ah, I'm not good at this. The thing was, he was a really nice guy. I felt lousy tolerating. <sighs> what on earth is that man doing? I didn't come to California to be a secretary. I want to make homicide. I know you made it. I think it's you. Reginald Barley, 
I'm charging you with committing a series of arsons and for the murders of Hank Sawyer, yes! Edwina Sawyer, Henry Sawyer, and Jessica Sawyer. I'm no cold-blooded criminal. I could never bring up a whole family in their home. Yes. Oh yeah, Andre. How is it Wouldn't not just any keep other way. your mouth shut and listen to me for a second? How is it you can bring no less than three suspects into my station, conduct extensive interviews, sift through mountains of evidence with I deserve and this. Pinker, and still manage to charge the wrong fucking guy? I did? I took a chance on you, Phelps. People said I was crazy, and you made me look like a jerk. How does he know it's the wrong guy? You may not be much of an arson investigator, but I hear you're merciless on the beat. Get going. Well, how does he know it was the wrong guy? Yes! Ah! I thought it was him. Uh, how long did that take us? Two hours, and I didn't even do the right guy? You're two blocks behind first and second. We have more buildings to clear. You know our orders, There's Sergeant. There's barely a building left standing or not on fire in your zone, Cole. Is your sector full of Japs? Questioning my command. The captain doesn't want anyone falling behind. I tell the captain we will join him when the job is done. Just give us the word, Sarge. We'll take care of him. He should be sectioned. That Jap lover's a fucking liability. We're here to kill Japs, not our own people. Starcross, son of a bitch. No one wants to serve under him. He's bad fucking luck. Can it? We have a job to do here. If I can live with it, you can too. Think you forgot to interrogate the arsonist you found on the second crime scene? No, he wasn't there, right? It was only the two of them. Can you imagine? If the third guy was there as well. <laughs> and I don't even bother questioning him. <laughs> oh, wow. Thanks. Got down. House fire. A bad one. At least four Vicks. Get out there and find out what you can. The address is... 650 North Hobart. No, he wasn't there, Chad. We never brought him in. I said we must in there and find the goddamn evidence. There he is. No, uh, it wasn't that we brought three suspects. It was that there were three suspects. But we never brought that third guy in. Pocket. We questioned him Phelps. on the street and then just said it, it's not him. He brought in that case with that poor lady killed in your city hall. Yes! Okay, three, let's say four victims on this one? about Rancho Escondido. Are we having a conversation, Biggs? Okay, fuck it. Forget I... I'm teasing you, Herschel. Tell me about it. Well, the new housing development is a couple of weeks from completion. Burned to the ground last night. GIs are ready to move in this weekend. 
Velvet is going to have some very angry customers. Any sentry unit, any sentry unit, you know, two levels in progress, 522 yes, South Hill Street, unit yeah, code 3, identified. He's still in custody, Herschel. Want to bet? Bill have kicked him loose already. Can't hold him for misdemeanor cigarettes and matches. Oh! Was that yes. guy there? The guy we caught on the street with the cigarettes. Could I have questioned him? Oh, I completely, he completely slipped my mind. Hey, just to answer your question, no, I'd be a fucking terrible detective. I'd be a terrible detective. There were four suspects. The third guy was the guy on the street. I forgot he was even a thing. We, we sent him in so early. Oh. Yes. God, who watches this? <laughs> It's just absolutely terrible. Clanten, Ililil, Beast ASAP, Mateus, Lucas Quality Content. Welcome back, guys. City Arc, thanks for the sub. Fadeless, Fadeless, thanks for the, the gifted subs. Much appreciated. Jacob Ram, Worstus, and Azazel. Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, I forgot about him. Did you guys remember him? I just thought the three guys, the three different boiler guys. I forgot that there was a guy on the street, that fire pervert. Rename the game to LA No IQ. I like that one. It's funny. Dude, I can't believe I forgot about that. Yeah, the pyro perv. Dude, he's just sat there. I don't even bother questioning him. There's always a fire perv. Oh, it's suburban redevelopment again. Oh god, here we go. The boss. You guys better see this. I hope you have strong stomachs. Do you have a name? Morelli, Mike. We recovered a picture of the family. Else? To be honest, I just got here, Phelps. Best you talk to Lynch. He's the expert. Doesn't make any sense. Why aren't they scattered around like the rest of the debris? I think they've been moved. Ooh. I think someone moved them after the explosion and before the fire. Can you explain that, please? I'm almost positive the cause of death is asphyxiation due to gas inhalation. Look at the parts of their bodies that aren't scorched. The coloring around the fingertips is typical. It wouldn't have felt a thing. I think the fire damage is post-mortem. I think someone moved him into this room after the explosion. It still doesn't make any sense. Why would you run into a burning building? Yes! What 
are you doing? The prayer effect is from the fire. The muscles and tendons contract. The guy on the right kind of looks like Teo's Gasm. Why are they all down on their knees? Never the same. Is that part of the prayer effect? You ever think about how many people have died in this world? And how big heaven would have to be to accommodate them, Biggs? No, I have not. Show some respect. It's our boy. I think he watches the fires. I think the Sawyer fire went wrong. So what about the guy we have in jail, Phelps? You got the wrong guy. That doesn't explain Sorry why about that. burning building. What would make anyone do that? Guilt. For the fires? For his mistake. This guy wants to burn houses, not families. He expects the houses to be empty. He was trying to redeem himself. He probably thought they'd be happier together. You are one very disturbed individual, Phelps. I know you had it rough lately, but you should start to compartmentalize your thoughts. You could be right. Can you come up with an alternative explanation? I'm sure it's the same guy. Are you telling me that some son of a bitch murdered these people, the whole family, and arranged them here like Cupid dolls? It might fit, Cole, but I don't think we could ever prove it. There's very little evidence. Oh! Evidence! Albert. Check out the hot water system. Make sure we're dealing with the same M.O. Sure, Phelps. I'll get back to you. Leave the rest to us, Cole. You better find out what's eating dig. First, I have to look for evidence. A ladle. Oh. It doesn't give me anything to go on. Let me go check out uh, Biggs. Eggs. So something finally got to you. You want my help, pretty boy? You got it. You keep riding me and you won't be pretty much longer. We can get this guy, Herschel. You think you've seen everything, Phelps? I was with the 2nd Marines at Bella Wood. The things that went on in that farmhouse. My own guys, on fire, screaming for a way out. You're not gonna get this guy. There's gonna be no photos and no citations. We're gonna kill this miserable fuck. End of story. You getting this? We're gonna kill him? You remember the list from the travel agent? Sure. The Morellis were winners too. Their name was on that list. Christ. We should take a look around, work the neighbors, see what they know. I'll go across the street. Okay, I'll try this side. I haven't done this for years. How bad is it? Come you on, don't you look like play. a fireman, son. LAPD, can you tell me anything about the fire next door? Terrible luck. Imagine after having won that weekend away. What's your name, sir? Foreman. Dudley Foreman. Did you see or hear anything that might have... Look, we were asleep when we heard the explosion. Does he really... Is he checking me out? Or is he hiding something? What do we think? Out. You didn't like Morelli, did you? Some neighbors you get along with, some you don't. Guess they should have sold up. What do you mean? They're knocking down all these old houses and building a new subdivision for GIs. Morelli was being difficult. You said someone is knocking these houses down? Elysian Fields. You must know them. They're billboards. That Monroe character beaming down at you. We've had an offer for the house. Did the Morellis want to sell? I don't know.
Whatever you thought of Morelli, his whole family is dead. They couldn't have all deserved that. I want you to help me here, Foreman. Morelli was pig-headed. He built the house himself. He didn't want to sell. Stubborn fool was ruining it for all of us. You said the Morellis had won a weekend away. To Catalina Island? Yeah, that's right. First thing I thought after the explosion was, thank goodness they was away. But then I find out they were still in there. Who was running the competition? What? I don't know. You didn't enter yourself? I'd already agreed to sell. The competition was an incentive for those who were still thinking about it. Doesn't make any sense. Why Napoli? Looks like the same model. Varley! You're still up to your old tricks, are ya? Yeah, I was thinking about that bully, but I guess he means he doesn't know... ...who was hosting the... ...the, uh, trips. Like, maybe like the... This the is traveling point. agency. The heater detonated with enough force to expose the foundations. Barty, the guy you put in jail? No, that was uh, Mike. Was his name not Mike? This doesn't pertain to the case. Oh wait, was it Mar- Was it Varley I put away? What was his first name? Varley his first name? Reginald Varley. Was that him? Okay. Ryan Varley. But I'm, I'm, ac I'm actually trash. Oh. I have that Corsair meeting coming up. One second. Just gonna check that it's on. Stream it. Now, I'll, I'll put some music on and mute my mic. I don't think it's gonna be a long meeting. 